What is up, guys? Welcome to another episode of Journey into Wild. Today's deck is called Spider Barrage Rogue, and this rogue deck tries to, quote, barrage the opponent both early and late with Patches of the Pirate and Leyline Spiders. The original idea was to revisit the deck Boom and Doom Rogue, which we used Hemet Jungle Hunter to speed up a Cthune endgame. What ended up keep happening, however, was me using Togwaggle Scheme not on the intended Blade of Cthune, but on Patches instead. This was so much fun that it ended up leaning into this synergy more, adding more pirates and swapping out the Cthune cards for Beldori Striders. The early game here is pretty simple. Try to mulligan for a card on turn two that will put more patches into the deck, like Gang Up or Lab Recruiter. And so from there, anytime you play a pirate, you get three 1-1 one, one patches onto the board. You're looking to repeat this cycle over and over until you get to Hemet Jungle Hunter, who in turn destroys your deck. And instead of summoning 1-1 one, one pirates over and over, you're going to try to summon 4-4 four, four spiders because the deck is down to almost nothing with Feldori Striders in it. Cannon Barrage didn't make it into the final deck like the name might suggest, but Ship's Cannon does a great job emulating its effect for much less mana without messing up your deck post Hemet Battle Cry. Hemet Jungle Hunter as a 6 mana 6-6 six, six is pretty much a Boulder Fist Ogre and generally a horrible tempo play, especially in Wild. Serrated Tooth, however, can give both him and the Leyline Spiders the much needed rush ability. Originally, the only cards I had over 3 mana were the 1 Hemet and 2 copies of Feldori Strider, but adding the 3 utility cards, Anti-Killbot, Lotheb, and Valir the Hallow made the deck much more versatile late game. I'm going to leave you guys with some gameplay. The extended video will be online tomorrow. Make sure to come back and check that out. I'll see you guys next time. Valira versus Mayev. Patches in hand is actually a little bit interesting because of the way I can set these up together guaranteed. Shadow step one back. I think we keep the shadow step and uh, the lab recruiter. This way we can play a pirate, shadow step patches, and then do that. If it's Baku, that thing just kind of dies. They all kind of die to Baku. Baku's an issue, huh? All right, we're going to YOLO. Like, most people are going to kill the 2-1, right? Yeah, I think most people are going to kill the 2-1. I want you and you and you. We're definitely going to have a lot of patches this game. <laughs> In fact, this is kind of hilarious, right? Oh my god. So we can go ship's cannon, play deck can, coin out scheme. Doesn't have haste or whatever, but. Maybe I just. Um, maybe I just bounce it, right? I could bounce the cannon. And then coin out this on that, and then one more pirate, and I get to do this again, right? Because if he kills this. You soon. Smart <laughs> Was that the play? Well, that's weird. So. Hmm. I can gang up, but then. I well, if I gang up, he might he might kill the wrong one, right? I mean... At this point, there's no wrong one. Yo -ho -ho! Warpath would be a card to play around, technically. Um... Whatever. Yo -ho -ho! If he Warpaths, that's fine, because then he, he can't Warpath later when we... We, uh, you know, get three more patches. Patches is... Let's try just another one drop pirate. No pirates. Don't think we we put this at risk, right? Here we go. I 
I could put three more in my deck, and if I the next time I get a pirate, we um no, I think it's better we just put like ten Lothabs in our deck at the end of the game because I'm gonna get to Lothab with Hammett, so. Ooh, we got brand we got brand brand value here. Um I'm just gonna do this next turn no matter what, probably so. Getting brand is good though, because it means I can heal bot later. I think we're just doing this and uh Welcome Tiger. So one issue we have is that if I do this too early, he, the bombs then start hitting me for sure. But because we have Healbot, Valera, Bran, I don't think we worry about that. I could, I could put this in my deck over and over. That's kind of funny. Bomb him back. Maybe Bran is what I want? No, it's gotta be Lothab. It's gotta be Lothab, because that stops Brawl. Stops Warpath, so... So I can do this. Kinda wanted these together, right? I think we make that to make it so we, the 4-4 four four is more relevant. The issue here is that, well, I hit him for less, but I think that makes more sense. We are open to Brawl, him winning the Brawl, which would be unfortunate. He's brawling. Fuck. And he won the Brawl, because of course he did. Alright, where are my spiders? Alright, we got a spider. Two spiders, not bad. So we have an issue, right? There's three bombs left, and uh well, I guess I just put heal bot in my deck, right? Here we go. I mean that could be awkward. Because like it's 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 a lot of healing, but I don't really want heal pot, right? He can Warpath, so there's not much reason to trade. Eh, I'll play a long game. Whatever. Thing is, if he does Warpath, it just clears room for uh, more spiders, so it kind of makes sense to... I guess if he trades, then, yeah, again, more spiders, but... My my way to win is, uh, is pretty much all in on these spiders, because I have eight heal bots, and, um... When we're Valera, yeah, we get to play two a turn, I guess, but that's still not much pressure. I must choose. Brawl be can be cast for 10 mana, so it's it's kind of important we wait until we get Valera to do this, right? To guarantee there's no spell. No. Oh, I have Bran out, so if I load up here, it's no spell. Alright, 
Alright, well, it looks like he's gone, but there's no... He could Dr. Boom, maybe stay alive. Dr. Boom, gain 7. So he could go to, theoretically, uh, 28 here. Which would definitely keep him alive, right? What is up, guys? Thanks for making it to the end of the video. You've gone this far. Help the channel out. Go a little bit further. Like the video. Comment below. And if you haven't already, of course, you need to subscribe to the channel. The extended gameplay video will be up tomorrow. I'll make sure to link it here once it is online. I'll see you guys next time.